Hey everyone, the question arose in the kitchen. How can a can like this be opened simply? Well, there are fancy can openers and then there is simple can opener. In this video, I'll show you how this very simple can opener works. It's about 20 cents, maybe 50. Okay, something like that. Or you can get two for a dollar. I don't know, something like that. Okay, it's, it's that simple. So all you see is all there is to it. What's important is that it be straight this way. It needs to have a notch here and it needs to have a sturdy enough blade, but it doesn't have to be super sharp. The proportions of this make this a successful can opener, not the thickness of metal. So it can be bent in half easily, but that's not how forces work on it or forces are applied. So you put your thumb somewhere here and it goes around the edge of a can like so. So that point will pierce through the lid and this hook here will catch the underside here. Okay, I hope that makes sense. So these are the two contact points. That one is piercing, this one is holding. And from here on, it needs to be rocked like so. Very, very straightforward. And it's not rocket science. So let's have a look, see? there okay so that's why it needs to be straight in this direction if it's bent in half whatever it can still work but uh, where you put your hand is important so your fingers don't need to be bending the item down here it needs to be rotated at around this axis here you just grab this knife here around this axis needs to be rotated like so okay so my thumb and index finger are pinching it there. It needs rotation. It doesn't need much bending and forcing up like so. So it obviously works. And all you do is work your way around. So uh, plunge in with it, move it over a little bit. Okay, move it forward a little bit and start all over again. Move it forward a little bit, start all over again, plunge it in move it over plunge it in like so move it over cut some metal or shear some metal it's technically it's shearing it there okay it works like this so this hook needs to be always catching the lip here and it, it shouldn't be sliding back if it slides back it's it's not productive so it needs to dig in dig in here at this point and then you can rotate it. It's very, very straightforward, yes? Of course, I imagine this needs a little practice, but whatever. If your hands are slippery, it's not gonna work too well, and it doesn't work with the left hand. It only works with the right hand like this, because that's how it's made, that's how it pivots. You can't repeat this with your left hand. It, it, there's no such configuration. There, I opened a can of beans. I guess I'll leave that for dinner. Okay, one last thing. The edges are jagged like this. So don't cut yourself. Don't try to lick the can, whatever. Okay, and it needs minimal dishwashing. Okay, minimal dishwashing. There you go. Thanks for watching.